Before you even think about heading home, he need those animation scenes finished. Looks like you will be staying late. Again. So, once again, I have to pull an all-nighter, meaning I have to work overtime, and I probably won't get paid for this. Again. <sighs> Sometimes I wish someone would just take me away from all this. Hey, wake up. You've got more work to do. Quit lazing around on the job. Hold on a sec. Does he not have a post? Maybe I've been working him too hard. Whoa. This is a problem. If word gets out that I've pushed my employees to the brink, my company's image is toast. Prison. That's the last place you want to be. I've got to cover this up. Make it look like he just quit or something. The staff doesn't need to know the truth. They just need to see us as the perfect, hardworking animation studio. Yeah, saying he quit should do the trick. Got to keep up appearances, even if it means sacrificing one for the team. Wakey, wakey, Edge. Time to get up. Oh, I must have fell asleep by doing all that work and what the heck? Sheldon, how are you alive? And why are you so big? What's going on here? I am sorry, Edge. I am not your character, Sheldon. I only took this form to make you feel more comfortable so you can accept the sad news a little easier. Okay, if you're not Sheldon, then who are you? And what do you mean by making the news a little easier for me? My name is Lumina, the goddess of reincarnation. And I'm sorry to say you passed away from exhaustion family. Your boss was pushing you too hard and your bunny finding just gave out. Are you serious? Damn it! That stupid boss of mine. I hope karma comes to bite him in the ass. If it makes you feel any better, I can make it so your former boss can have Hey Charlie Horse for the rest of his life. Ouch. What the hell? Where did this Charlie Horse come from? Okay, the job is done. Your former boss shall now have a Charlie horse for the rest of his life. So, what happens now? Is this the part where you judge me and send me to either heaven or hell? Actually, I'm going to reincarnate you now. Wait, are you serious right now? Of course, I can't send you back to the world you came from. There's certain rules involved for that. But as a consolation, I can send you to the world did you painstakingly create it. And it's a bonus, I'll let you keep using your laptop. How does that sound? Are you kidding, Lumina? I would be a fool to pass off that deal. Let's do it. Excellent, Edge. Now close your eyes. The next time you open him, you will be in your new world with all your memories intact and in a new body. Wow, I really am in another world. Whoa, and my clothes changed too. I should look around and see if there's anything here I can use. Oh, almost forgot my laptop. It looks like there's a house nearby, and it seems like there's a sign near it. It probably says something like, Pick up dog or something. Well, I guess I'm not going that way then. Are you freaking kidding me? He's literally ignoring the house I'm giving to him. I guess I just have to be more direct. <laughs> Take a better look at the sign, you idiot. Oh, it's a free house to anyone who wants it. Is this a gift from you, goddess? Tay, at this point, I'm feeling like you're messing with me, Edge. Just go in the house already.